Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hi everyone, this video is in continuation of our previous video on attendance and payroll system. In previous video, we generated QR code based employee cards and then using that card, we made time in and time out entry. In this video, we will see how these entries will be used to make attendance and payroll report. Before diving into this video, important thing to keep in mind is that this system may not be useful for every company. But this video will help you to understand the unknown power of Google Sheets using which small businesses can automate many of their processes on which many big companies spend thousands of dollars. You can see our channel videos to see how you can use Google Sheets to automate different business processes. Or you can share your current business processes with us and depending on our availability, we will tell you how we can automate your business processes. Now coming to the attendance system. This is the attendance sheet in which I have inserted some dummy data for the month of January 2020. The data in this sheet will be filled using QR code as we have shown in part 1 of this video series. From this sheet, we came to know that on which days employee was present. However, there are some days for which entries are missing. That means employee was absent on those days. But was he absent because of some holiday or weekend or was he on leave for some personal reason? Whatever the case is, system doesn't know that. User will have to provide system weekend of the company and company or public holidays based on which it will calculate the company off days and employee leaves and off days. Here in the sheet holidays and weekends, user have to give this information. In the first table, he simply have to take the weekend days of the company and in the, sec and in the second table, he have to write date and details of all the company and public holidays. Once it's done, attendance report is ready to be used. User can see report from attendance report tab. This report is fully automated and user just have to select month, year and employee ID and report will be updated according to the selected criteria. Right now we have entered just one month of data. Once user have multiple months or multiple years data then he can use these three filter options to get report as per his requirement. As we only have data of employee Rashid Anwar for the month of January 2020, so I will select that. As you can see, summary have been updated showing whether the employee is present today along with the number of working days in the selected month and the leaves and the presence of employee in the month. If user want to visualize this on calendar, then he simply will have to click on this plus button and calendar will be expanded showing the days on which employee was present in the green color, absent days in red color, holidays in magenta color and weekend in yellow color as can be seen in the header. That's it for the attendance report. This is the first version of this system. More things may be added on the user demand as per his requirements. I hope you must have enjoyed watching this video. In our next video, we will be showing you the payroll generation from the entered data. So stay tuned with our channel to get the update. In case, if you want to purchase this system or have any other query regarding this system, then feel free to get in touch with us on our Facebook page or you can email us on info at gsheets.com. Thank you.